Hey everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. Now, one of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device. It's something that Google initiated back in Android 5 to where when an Android device is factory reset without first removing the Google account that's on it, it's then going to ask for that account again as a security measure after the reset is performed. Now, here with us today, we happen to have a Verizon Wireless Galaxy S6 Edge Plus from Samsung, of course. And this is a device that does have the Google account lock enabled here. As we can see, as we're going through the setup steps, we get to this screen that says that the device was reset. And to continue, we have to sign in with the same account that was previously on the device. So it will not allow us to go through with just any old account. We are making this video to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to remove this type of lock from this device. We've actually already done 99% of the work ahead of time so that we can keep the video nice and short. So we should just be able to restart the phone once and then after going through the setup steps We should be able to see that we can then get all the way through the setup steps without seeing that Google lock We've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us to assist them with this specific issue Usually either because they themselves got accidentally locked out of their phone and couldn't remember their login information or couldn't reset their password or whatever the case may be. Or the other thing that commonly happens is unfortunately there are a lot of dishonest sellers out there who will sell someone a used phone without telling them that the lock is enabled and then obviously once the seller tries to go to set it up they're not going to have the login information to try to be able to get through. And I should mention this is something that we can do for just about anyone anywhere in the world so you don't necessarily need to be here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer and a fast internet connection and we can connect directly to you right through the internet and do the same thing that we did here. Now, obviously you can see the phone is restarted so we're going to go ahead and start going through all of the setup steps here. We're going to agree to some information here and then tap next and then it's going to take us to Wi-Fi and actually we don't need that so we can just go ahead and disconnect it and then hit skip. And then we're going to skip that. And then we're going to go through Google services. And that's going to ask us for a name, but we don't need one. And that's a good sign because this is the same point where normally we would have seen the Google lock before. So that is a very good indication that it has indeed been removed. We're going to skip through a few more things here. And then we are all done. Whoop, just kidding. We also have to skip the Samsung account because we don't need that. Okay, now we're all set to go. So we are at the home screen here now. We have full access to all the apps and settings and features, and this is just like a brand new device that never had the Google lock on it. While I'm here, I'm going to jump into the settings just to show you exactly what we were working with. So indeed, here we do have a Verizon Galaxy S6 Edge Plus, and that model number there, the G928V, is what uniquely identifies this as the Verizon model. So, if you have one of these devices and need help getting the Google account lock removed, we would love to help you out with that, so go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description, and I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all of the details there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. Make sure to hit that subscribe button while you're there also to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like this one. Y para todos los hispanos hablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.